YouTubers, welcome back to Yorkshireman 66. I'm Mark, your host, your entertainer today. Well, almost everything. Yeah, I am the entertainment officer on this channel. <laughs> right, so here we go with my PlayStation, my my PlayStation Collection Games 2. This is what it's all about. This is part two. So here we go with another exciting episode. Catch you all in a bit. Here we go now. Now, if you do like it, so please like the channel. Please subscribe. Please hit that information bell and I and it all. Please share the video to Facebook, Twitter, to anybody who, who really wants to watch it. And please comment below. I try and answer all comments, as you can see. So, now as you can see I'm in a different, th th there's no window behind me, the only reason why that is because um, someone did mention on a couple of videos that, oh some were at your back and we could hardly see you, oh, well, well I thought that were a bonus actually, where you couldn't see me, you know what I mean, I thought that were a bonus but no, I, uh, so I decided I turn the chair around, and as you can see, I've got, I've got, I've got the aerials here, the games are the back of here, so I thought I'd do it this way around and make everyone happy, sort of thing. Um, but as you can see, yeah, I'm not the best looking guy, and, and also, will this look it? Yeah, too much is that. So here we go. So this is. Uh, in my mind, a good, a very, very good, it, it, it's my favourite, all-time favourite, one of my all-time favourite games of all time, which is Gran Turismo A-Spec, which is a good thing, it really is, it's a damn good game, I do like it, I, 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 and I rate it very much, and, yeah, well, it, it was complete, I couldn't, I don't know how that come. It's definitely complete. I don't know how that came about, but that won't be cut out. <laughs> I think this wanted to go in the bin. No wrong with disc. I'll take that for nothing. So, um, my second, you know, but like I said, I, I, I am going around taking all the, the, the price stickers off. Slowly but surely. Um, some of these games, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, you've got to appreciate there's a hell of a lot of games. Now this is Burnout Revenge. This is Burnout Revenge. It, it's a very good game actually. It really is a, a really, really cool game. And it, 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 it really is. Uh, that's Burnout Revenge. Um, I don't know. This next game... It, it come from a film. I, I like the film was all right to me. It's you know the film was all right. It, you know it, it's it's black art down. I don't know about the game. I, I really don't really know, but it's come complete. Well, complete. I think it's complete. So I'm quite happy with that. But I don't know about this game. I mean, I know about the film. The film is a good film. A bit boring in parts, but it's a good film, I suppose. You know what I mean? It's a film that I won't. I, I'm not, I, I, I don't recommend it. Put it that way. Yeah, if you can get it cheap, then pick it up. But don't don't pay a lot of money for it. It's not worth getting. Now we've got Hitman. Hitman Contracts, which is a good game. I play I play some eight man games on that and I play this for about ten minutes just to make sure it works and it it did. It 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 ew. Butterfingers today, I'm telling you, I've got butterfingers. And there you go. So yeah. That's the eight man one. I'm telling you, I don't know what's wrong with me lately. Well, I do, and I do well I do know what's wrong obviously, but Now, IndyCar series, I don't see a lot of this on, how can I play, out in wild. You might do where you live, but not where I live. This is the Indianapolis 500, and it's, it, it is, it, it is by, by Co-Masters. 
So I expect it to be a good game. Now, I don't know if it will be a good game. I don't know if it'll be a bit like, like Formula 1, but it's done by Codemasters, genius at, genius at play. Hang on. I think I spotted something wrong with this. Probably. No, there's nothing wrong with that. Ooh, I thought there was something wrong with it. I, I have tested it. I do, I do know it works. But there you go. Uh, spindle's broken in that. I'm going to have to change the case, I think. Which is shame, because it's a, it's, a, yeah, it's a very clean case. Um, I've got pre-owned. I've got Tom Clancy's Splinter Cell, a double agent by Ubisoft. So there you go. Yeah, again, it's a Ubisoft game. What is wrong with all that? Is my disc walk into a... Every... See, every other one's been looked. This will lose. I think it's trying to tell me I want to be played. <sighs> I'm going to have to get these games back out. I think, I think they're trying to tell me some of my PS2 games. I think they're trying to tell me that they want to be played. So that split itself. Um, PlayStation Two, Metal Gear Solid Three, The Snake Eater. Watch. Ah, you're not escaping. <laughs> so there you go. It is complete. It really is complete. And that. I mean, most of my PS2 games are. I mean, I, I I don't know if I've got one or not. Pre-owned? I don't know where that come from. Did, did that come from game? I don't know if it does or not. I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, but I keep the old stickers on any case, except for price. Oh! oh. What? Loose, 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 loose again! Are you trying to tell me something, game? Because if you are... I think they try to tell me. Play me! Again. Oh, I've played years. No, I'll be playing years again. So, yeah, Second Sight. It's a very good film. It's a very good film. It ought to be a film, Second Sight, but it's a very good game. And it's it's done by Free Radical. It's, it's done by Codemasters. It's a Codemaster game, so no wonder it's a good game. Yeah, it's, it, it, it is a very good game. I really like that. I really do. Again, another, another good game. I think it's the. I think this is supposed to be in the. Yeah, it's a plat. It's supposed to be platinum, isn't it? it yeah, it, it says it is. It's Colin McRae Rally Two Thousand and Five by Codemasters. Genius at play. Yeah, it's, it's definitely all the Colin McRae Two Thousand and Five Rally, platinum. But that don't matter because I'm. Yeah, I am collecting platinum as well. I mean, you've got to collect them all. And yes, you do end up with a lot of. Uh, how can I put it? You end up with hell of a lot of doubles, but if you're collecting platinum, then you need the platinum games as well. Well, people don't seem to understand that. Right. Is this? Nope. This is good. Oh, I thought this one got a bit first one without its, you know, but, but yeah. It, it, it's PDC World Champion Dirt, which is absolutely crap. It is. Gameplay is rubbish. Everything about it is rubbish. I've seen better dark games. Trust me, I've seen better. But this is rubbish. It's even rubbish on bloody Wii, I tell you. It's unplayable on Wii. I, I think. What it makes is it's not so bad on Switch if you get, yeah. You, know, you go like that. Do, don't let go at Joy-Con, though. But, yeah. But, no. What worst games I've got in my collection is that. Um. Uh, ooh. I've got Burnout Free Take Down. Now this. Oh. You've let me down. This is first one, lads. No booklet. So this is Burnout Free Take Down. It, so I'll get a booklet eventually for it. Take Down Free. Never mind. I will have to find a booklet for it. 
fantastic price thing off this. Yeah, you know, I, I, you know, I should have done it when I first got them. And people say, don't you take your stickers? Oh, no. I never have, in a way. Because I know, I know viewers don't like it when you've got stickers all over boxes and that. Oh, well, it, it, yeah, I, I think it's... Well, yeah, but it's a way of me of, of keeping track of, of, of what I paid. But I'm bottling to pressure, I tell you. So there you go, Mortal Kombat, which is a very good game, actually, is Mortal Kombat. Um, that is one hell of a... It's one hell of a game. So Mortal Kombat, The Deception. Yeah, I do like the Mortal Kombat games, I really do. Um I come across Mortal Kombat when I am becoming an Amiga and things like that. <laughs> so yeah, Mortal Kombat The Deception. I like the new Mortal Kombat as well, with the uh, Mortal Kombat 10, 11, and, and yeah, you know, so on and so on. I like all of them as well. Not many people do, but I do. I like a, I like what they've done with it. And that. But there you go. And I've got... And I've got this. Now this is now this I've got it all. It's a steel case and I've got it all up. I even got the bonus disc, I've got everything in here with this. It is one hell of a game and yeah, it's a steel book. It's one hell of a game. I got that brand new when I originally owned it. Originally, I got that brand new, and it was only fifteen quid at the time, new. So I don't know how much it is now. So I definitely got it when I had it. I had it. Yeah, I mean, it 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 it, it is. If you like that kind of game, then you're going to like this. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm taking the sticker off from where I bought it from. The little sticker saying game on it. Yeah. It, it, it's by EA as well. EA game, so. Electronic Arts, really good. So, that's, that's the first lot. Here comes the second lot. Uh, like I say, if there's any games what you know of and, and, and you like, you know, you, you can tell me what game players like, then please tell me in the comments below. I'm always, I'm always, I'm always, 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 always respectful of people who know better than me. And that, you know, it's, it, it won't be very much more information than what I would already know. But it's always nice to see knowledge, if you know what I mean. I'm always wanting to learn new knowledge. And things like that so yeah so there you go so here we go this is 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 Gran Turismo 4 this came after as we all know Gran Turismo 3 expert and they they had a lot of following with Ace but I think this one got a bit boring this this one this Gran Turismo yeah, I mean, I think this one got a bit boring, but Gran Turismo 4, the real simulator. But as you can see, you, you've got old cars and that, you know what I mean? Um, the water game, what I used to play on Dreamcast, it was called 19, uh, Spirit of Speed in 1937. That was a good game. It, it really was a good game. And Sega hadn't remastered that one neither. Like, they haven't remastered No at all. Come on, Sega, get your get your finger out. Start remastering some decent Dreamcast games for other systems. You know you want to. Um, but yeah, no matter. So as everyone will know, UK Crow he did a bit of a thing thing on it, and he dedicated it to me. He did a bit of a play on with No Matter So. Now, I do like No Matter So, and. You kick it out knows why I like it. I mean, the visuals is unbelievable. David Bowie music is very good. Very unbelievable. 
Yeah, yeah, it was well thought out game with that. It, they just didn't jump on. This is uh, EA Sports F1 Championship season. Now EA used to do the Formula One before Codemasters. Hey, even I know that, um, and that's the two thousand. But Codemasters, yeah, you know, this is the definitive Formula One experience. This is the licensed one as well. F1 2000, so yeah, it's a good game. It really is. Um, again, what is is getting harder to find? Um, I, I do imagine Yorkshire lads show 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 this game and that. But the difference is between. I don't know if Yorkshire lads ever played it, but I have. I played the game and it's not that good. It's not what you think. Yo, yo. It it's not what you think it is. Because you would honestly think, yeah. So it's by Ubisoft. I'm not going to take it away. Ubisoft. It's play, play by the mansion. Very hard game to find, and if you can find it, it can be very expensive, as well. I was looking to pay a couple of quid for this, and that. But play by mansion, Ubisoft. Yeah, and yes, it is complete. Is that one? That's played by Mansion. It is getting an hard game to find, actually. Um, so is this game, really? I, I had the film of this. I haven't got the film anymore. But they did do a film of it. But it, it's Rockstar what did it. What did the game. But um, they did what they could do with it. And, that, and, and this is called Warriors. There is a film of the same name, exactly. Yeah, it does come from a film. But what Rockstar have done with this game is pretty ingenious because it works, if you know what I mean. It, well, it's the only game. It's the only thing. The game's followed the film. The game wasn't made first, then the film. It was the film first, and that, then this came out. And, and, and Rockstar have made it work. They really have. They haven't detracted too far from the film. In my opinion, you know, a, a lot of films, a lot of, a lot of games, what what have been, you know, made or games and films have been made from. The only people who would really want to watch watch that kind of film is like I've got Need for Speed from, and I, and I would definitely rate that film as a decent film actually. But on on it, people what I want to read it. Who, who's a fan of Need for Speed? It's only fans what watch these films, as we all know. I'm a, I'm a fan of uh, second one with no cover. I'm a fan of um, Assassin's Creed when they did the Assassin's Creed film. Yeah, it's completely different from game. I know that, but really, yeah, doesn't relate to me. If you know what I mean. I I only thought they'd do another one. But they never out. They done another Need for Speed, which does, which I think they should do. But I think they're only making these like films from games, like a one-off sort of thing. Um, and they did same with the only other game I know. What's got two, two films out of it is um, Tron. Is the Tron films? Yeah, you got your Tron Classic, then you got your new Tron, haven't you? That Legacy. Um, and I've got them. You know what I mean? Again, because I'm a fan of Tron. I'm a fan of the game. But I do like the films as well. So, but... Tron came first out of the... Out of the... How can I put it? The games came first out of that lot, then the film. But at the time, when they made the film Tron... It 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 run the tell you how old it is. It run VHS and beta max films. Uh, there you go. Nine yeah. Not many people like this, but I do. I think it's uh, it's the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Not many people like it, but I do. I do love the film. I I, I like I like the Chronicles of Narnia, and I I like the, the old. I like the old TV series as well. 
Not many people will understand that, but I do. But yeah. So that's Chronicles of Narnia. A lot of people don't like it, but I rate the, I rate the game. I give it an eight out of ten. And that. I mean, people forget Rockstar made other games as well. This is what people forget as well. So they made the Warriors. Rockstar made a lot more games than what people give them credit for. You know, they, they seem to get a lot of recognition for Grand Theft Auto. But they did make a hell of a lot of games. I must admit, I mean, they did bully, didn't they? And table tennis games and things like that. But they also did this game. Man on... That's a good one. Now, this is the original Man Hunt. I do know because I have bit, I have looked at it, Violent Video Enterprises. I, I, I have. Um, so it, it ain't got a manual, but it has got. You know, it, it's got a catalog. What came with it? But uh, yeah, Man Hunt. Well, that's the original game, is that? It's the one what got banned, basically. But Rockstar, again, they did Smuggler's Run 1 and 2. They, they did, they've done some cracking games as Rockstar, but they only seem to get recognised for, like, Grand Theft Auto and Red, Red, De Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, I think we should recognise them for a lot more than that. Yeah, right. Isn't it funny that they've never wanted to make a film out of Rockstar Games, eh? Especially Red Dead Redemption. That would make a good film, wouldn't it? I tell you, a good western. You get the right person involved. So there you go. King Kong. This is uh, Peter Jackson's King Kong. The film's cracking film. The game. It's hard, eh? It's a good game. But it takes forever to do your mission, doesn't it? <laughs> so that's the only thing I can say bad about it. But I give it a 7 out of 10. Um, cricket 07. Well, I'm not into cricket, but if you want him to collect every game, then it comes with its, comes with its manual. It comes with everything, with manual and everything. Um, it does come with its, its gubbins as well. But yeah, it comes with everything. But I'm not into cricket games. But, if you're collecting them all, you've got to have them. And that's only what people say to me. People say, oh, well, you've got to have it, you've got to have it. Thank you. Well, no, not really, I don't have to have them. I should be collecting games what I want, not what other people dictate that I should have. But I am trying to get to get a full UK power set any case which is no no I can't get that off it's gonna take some super to get that off but there you go that's the uh, the getaway is it which one is it yeah no it's just it's the first one the very first getaway Let's see if I can get a new box for that. It's the very first getaway. It does come complete with tattoo box. So it does come complete. Um, found this. Uh, yeah, hmm, definitely found it. It's definitely for PlayStation Two, and it's Cool Shop Pool. Cool Shop Pool. Ignore that. I didn't pay ten quid for it. <laughs> I only paid a, I only paid fifty p for this one. See, got all stickers off it. Good, good game. And then we've got Euro two thousand and four Portugal. Ranger Games, which is a good one. EA Games again. They do do some good games. You wait for that. They do. They do. 
to do some good games. I know they were a bit of an argument with him, weren't they, a couple of years ago, about, you know, what they were doing and that, but... It, 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 you know, a bunch of gamers complaining, or try to boycott EA games. It's not going to make... It's not going to do much for a multi-million pound company. You know, EA games could back in tomorrow, but like what I tell people, they've already made their money. You know, their, their money were made years and years ago. They're just wanting to see if they can add to that. And and that's what they're doing. I won't say they're greedy. Because if, I think if I were someone like EA, and I owned EA games, I'd continue to go. And, I, and I'd, I, I'd go down the path where I would you know, think, well, yeah, I can make money at this. And this is what I want to do. Yeah, if I can make a company twice as rich, you do it. <laughs> you just do it, don't you? Right then, so this is Tucker Race Driver 3. Tucker Race Driver 3. Good game. I give it 9 out of 10. I really do. It, it does. It, it is a good game. Better than second one. I need some more games. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to be a long video, but then again, who cares? Who really cares? I've, I've been told longer the better, so there you go. Longer the better, lads, longer the better. So, yeah. So this is another game, what I've liked. Um, you know, I want people to say, oh, no, it, no, you can't, no. No, they're ripping off from so-and-so. No, they're not. Crash Bandicoot is a damn good game. I like it. But, sadly, the thought manual. That's the third one we're at. Then we've got The Driver. Parallel Lines, which is a good game. It really is. Really is a cracking game, is this? And I will tell you that for nothing. It is a smasher. But yeah. I would say, between this and San Francisco, them two are about the best, about the best ones. The first, second one were... First one... Uh, first, first three were rubbish. But this... And San Francisco for me was really good. Um, thrill, thrill, Bill, off the rails. I like this, even though it's an old game. I do like it. I like to build. You know, you're building up your, uh, your you know, you're building a roller coaster, basically. Um, I do like it. I, I need to get the uh, oh, what is it now? Roller co roller coaster planet for PS4. I need to get that. See, another game we have that. Um, that's four fun. Night Rider, the game. I want number two to this. I want number two. I haven't got that, unfortunately. But yeah, I've got got Night Rider, the first one. Um, Star Wars Battlefront for the PS2. Yeah, they've always had a Battlefront, haven't they, on, on PlayStation? This is no different. Some Battlefronts are better than others. Yes, at the time, it was good. But it never lived up to its hype. I think people overhyped it, literally. You know, I think especially when they were showing it on telly. Yeah, you know, they were showing you best, best, best scenes of it and that. They weren't showing you exactly. What, what the gaming community wanted to see it was i think it was just over eight were star wars but often i think a lot of them are but it's you got to understand it's before star wars but went bad i mean star wars under disney it is bad it's not that good or fantastic really but it was bad it, it really was so yeah san andreas by rockstar that's another good game it, it really is it's a fantastic game i like it if you want my opinion from number three upwards, these are the best. I'll tell you that now. So you, you, you've got you've got uh, uh, Liberty City stories, Miami Vice stories. Them two are good. San Andreas. Um, you've got uh, Grand Theft Auto Four. That's a good game. 
and then number five was a good game. But then you had the offshoots, didn't you? Liberty City stories and Liberty and Miami Vice stories, which are good. But the first, the first couple of them, I don't like. So this is Rainbow Six Lockdown. <laughs> Sorry to say that, but yeah, Rainbow Six Lockdown. I can just imagine government trying to do that. Oh yeah, Lockdown for definite. <laughs> Sorry about that laughing, but yeah, I find it really funny. Uh, yeah, I really do. Um, yeah, so that's well, I'm talking about uh, Grand Theft Auto 3, it's here, that's number three. That's a very good one, I, I, I do like it. Then go and fetch a auto. I do have the China Wars one for PSP, but that one, it's like showing you from top down, isn't it? Like the old plastic one. Um, yeah, Grand Theft Auto, Liberty City Stories. These are good games. These are really good games. I do rate them. I rate them very highly. Um, that one's definitely. Ooh. This one's got paperwork. I wonder why. Cheat codes. <laughs> I've got cheat codes with it. Now, this is very good when you get cheat codes. Oh, that's unbelievable. So, there's a lot of cheat codes there, but I can use. Oh. Might be a bit tanking to it. So you got so I got some cheat codes with that. Right? So that's a good thing. Not, oh, excuse me, it's not a bad thing. I can't get stickers off on more logs, but I've tried. Jump yeah. This is Moto GP. Which one is it? It says Moto GP. I don't know what year it's from, but it's a platinum one. Oh, it's better lot now. It's definitely a platinum. Is it a platinum disc? Yeah, it's platinum disc now, cool. It's a good game. Oh, there you is Moto GP. I had to find it out to do. Then I've got Medal of Honor. I've got the front line. I've got the uh, platinum edition. And it's definitely the platinum. <laughs> yeah, platinum, and I've got the booklet to go with it as well. I'm gonna have some good fun putting all these away. And then I've got Late Masters e EX. So Late Masters EX. It's a good relaxing game. If you ain't got nothing to do for five minutes, you can play on this and relax. It, it chills you out. I like a lot of fishing games. And then I've got, ooh, now I don't know about this one. This is the Go, uh, Go Go Copter. Now I don't know how good this will be. It looks alright from there, but I don't know what it's about or not like that. Flight of Victory and things like that. I don't know how good this will be. Uh, remote control Go Copter. Go Go Copter. So it's RC. It's, it's done by Explosive Games. So, yeah, it's all there. I think it's all there. Oh, no, it ain't. I ain't got the book for it, but there you go. But it's Go Go Copter. I see it's from remote control. I don't know how good a gameplay it will be, but there you go. So, so there you go. Um, Yeah, I know it's got a bit dark, isn't it? I could have sat there in any case, but I thought, nah, it's a different handle what you see to usual. Um. 
I didn't notice how dark it's got. Because it was too dark. That's a bit better, isn't it? Well, is that too bright? Yeah, I think that'd be too bright for you. Um, I think that'd be too bright for you. So, yeah, like I say, I just wanted to give a, a few, you know, a few bits and bats of views and that, you know what I mean? So there you go. So that's my PlayStation collection number two. Hmm. A bit longer than usual, but I, 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 I hope you've liked it. If you have, please give me a thumbs up. Please like the video. Please subscribe if you really want to subscribe. And if you really, you know, you know, like this kind of content, you might have been looking for something completely different. You might have been looking for for, for somewhere to think like how to cook with a Yorkshireman. Well, I don't do cooking, and it's as simple as that. But if you want to really subscribe, it's free to subscribe. So please, you don't lose anything by by subscribing. You, you know, I don't it don't charge you or all like that. And, and please share the video, share it to your friends and your family and other multimedia like Twitter and Facebook and things like that. And please comment below. I would much appreciate it if you did comment below. I try and answer all comments as much as I can. And I'll catch you on the next video. Bye for now.